Hey guys, welcome back to the city stead. So we're working on that bench today in the greenhouse. find a good vantage point for you so let's put you down over here so I got this nice space over here and this is where I want to build a little table so I can do my starts on and I got all that wood from the ramp we took apart the other day in the garage I think we're gonna use that be able to make a nice little long table and I got to keep in mind if I want to move this in and out of here that I got to make it narrower than my door over there it's so hot in this greenhouse, even with the door open, that my glasses are fogging up. Can you see that? <laughs> now that is what I like to see. Last night, it was close to 50 degrees in here all night. So I think the low was actually 47 on the uh, thermostat. But that's incredible, man. So we're definitely in the point where we could probably start starting start those seeds in here, which is what the plan is, so let's go get some work done. Come on, let's get out of here. Out into the cool weather. This is how you know you're a Michigan kid. 60 degrees outside today, and we're busting out the water tape. Now I am not a finished carpenter and in the interest of just trying to get this done because I don't know how big my window of time is, I'm going really rough with this. I'm not doing any kind of fanciness so if you guys see it looking sloppy, that's well because it is. And batteries will get you every time. So what I'm doing here is I'm putting a top across the top of my legs and I made my legs about three feet tall. Then I'm putting a second one about six inches up. What I want to use these for is shelving. Kind of like to hold the shelf. So I want a lower shelf and an upper shelf. So one side down, one more to go. So earlier when I was talking about slapping that together as fast as I could, this is the reason why right here. The girls are gone today, so I have the boys. And this guy was up sleeping. But he woke up earlier than I thought. 
So we gotta put the uh, little table for the greenhouse on hold for a minute. And wait for the girls to get home now. Can you say hi to everyone? No? <laughs> All right, we'll get back to that table in a, in a minute, I'm sure. Guys, my worries are over. The garlic is popping up. I am super, super excited about this. I was really starting to wonder if I was gonna get any this year, and now I see a lot of it coming through here, so I'll show you guys the little garlic sprouts. I don't know how Justin Rhodes does it all the time. He makes it look so easy with those kids. Look at this, I got one running around with a mallet, I got one in a stroller, just to try to get a little work done. Did Justin vlog when they were just babies? It'd be interesting to see. I don't think the baby cared for that that much. Can I go grab him? <laughs> that was not as easy as I thought it was going to be. So why sometimes it's easy to build things where you want them already. But not too bad. Alright. So that looks pretty good. So I just put a center support in here and make it a little more sturdy. I'm gonna put a top on top of it, some plywood or something. I do the same with that bottom shelf. Just so it can hold a little more weight. I don't have to worry about anything. The super sturdy little shelf. And when I go to put these on there, I should be able to put them either this way, or if I really wanted to stretch them out, I think I can do them this way. That gives me room for three, that's pretty good. So I'm pretty happy about that, but I think most likely they're gonna go like this. Which in that case, we can fit probably six trays across the top of this thing. And if we really wanted to do more, we could do another six on the bottom, or probably five, because there's uh, the board in the way for the leg. But not too bad for the little uh, workbench in there. I know it's not as pristine and perfect as some people's are, but I am in a rush. My work schedule is about to pick up again, and I don't know how much time I have before spring comes to get all this stuff done. So I'm just trying to get as much as I can, as quick as I can. So quick and easy, cheap little table. I'm just going to put some plywood on top of it, and we're going to get some seats started, hopefully in the next couple of days. Till then, we'll see you guys later. I'm out of here. <laughs>